Bismillah Rahman Rahim. In the name of Allah, most gracious, most merciful. Dear learners, today I am going to start Pearson Reduction A-level exam for Mechanics 1. This exam is taken in May June session year 2023. Paper reference code is WME01-01. Let us start with question number 1. A particle A has mass 4 kg and particle B has mass 2 kg. The particles move towards each other in opposite directions along the same straight line on smooth horizontal table and collide directly. Immediately before the collision, a speed of A is 2 u meter per second, speed of B is 3 u meter per second. Immediately after collision, the speed of B is 2 u meter per second. The direction of motion of B is reversed by collision. Find in terms of u the speed of A immediately after the collision. So this question could be solved by using law of conservation of momentum. Let me draw the diagram for this question, this type of question. Almost the diagrams are similar for collision questions. Okay. Uh, let's say this is particle A that has mass 4 kilogram. This is particle A and the other particle is B. Its mass is 2 kg. It is stated in the question that here at the top of this, uh, this object we are writing the stuff before collision and at the bottom we are writing for after collision. Almost the diagram is similar for all these type of questions. Okay, So memorize this one. It is given in the question that A and B they are moving along each other towards each other like uh, in opposite directions like if this is moving this way. Uh, B is moving like that. Okay. Before the collision, it is given here. Immediately before the collision, the speed of A is 2u. So here we can write the speed 2u and speed of B is 3u. It is given here as well. So you can write the speed 3u. Okay. After collision, the speed of B is 2u. The direction of motion of B is reversed. Look here, it was moving left side. So we will change the direction of motion for B here. So, and speed of B is given here, that is 2u. Speed of A is not given, that is your choice. You can take uh, the same direction or you can change the direction, that is your choice. What do you think, okay? For example, if we are getting the positive answer, we will keep the same direction. If you get negative answer, we will reverse our direction, okay? That's uh, your choice. Here, I am considering this way, no problem. This direction, you can uh, take either way, no problem, okay? That is your choice. Here, the speed after collision for A is V. We can say the final speed after the collision is V for A. That's it. So, this is the stuff. Even though if you go into more, uh, in addition to all of this, even though you can draw the direction for impulse, impulse direction is always like that. Okay. So, this will be I this way and here I will be that way. It is They are always equal but opposite in direction. So this is the diagram for these questions. Okay, so you have to memorize it. Now we can apply the law of conservation of momentum. That is m1 u1 plus m2 u2 equals to m1 v1 plus m2 v2. Plug in the values, and here we are considering the right side positive direction. Considering the direction is very important. Here I am considering right side direction positive before the collision. The mass of A is M1, okay? That will be 4 and speed before collision was 2, 2U. So, you can write 2U here. This is 2U. Plus M2 before collision. Mass is 2 and uh, before collision speed is 3U. So, you can write here. Uh, 2 for mass and U2 is the speed because we are considering the right side positive. Therefore, you have to take this one negative, okay? This point is very important. Many students doing mistake in choosing the direction. Because we are choosing right side positive, so this will be negative, this one. Look, look at this arrow, okay? This will be negative. Now, plug in the value for after collision. After collision is at the bottom. M1 is 4 and speed we, we are keeping uh, right side, so it will be the same for V. And M2 is 2 and V2 is uh, the same positive, so we will keep the same. That is 2U. Okay, now you need to solve it. It is 8u minus 6u will be 
to u okay and uh, you can bring this one to left side so it will be minus 4 u okay and it is equals to 4 v now 4 v is equals to minus 2 u and here v will be equals to uh, you know this 4 will divide to the other side and minus 2 divided by 4 will be minus 1 over 2 minus 1 over 2 u we want to find actually this is the direction minus half minus you are getting here negative answer okay Be why we are getting negative answer this one uh, we have to reverse our direction so direction is not same what we suppose okay you have to reverse our direction like uh, before it was moving right side so finally because of negative sign you can say it will reverse its direction okay uh, so we can uh, we can mention from this minus minus is not important here we are writing always the magnitude minus gives you the direction only okay hopefully you understand this point uh, what is the question let's go back we want to find speed speed is always the magnitude of the velocity therefore speed of a we need to find the speed of a speed of a will be equals to 1 over 2 u uh, you can keep the unit meter per second. So, this is the answer for the first part. First part is done. Got it? Why are choosing here minus? Uh, we, we have to ignore this one. Magnitude is always positive. Now, for second part, state the direction of motion of A after the collision. After the collision. You know, we, we kept this direction right side, but it will reverse actually because of negative sign. Okay, negative sign. So, we can write here the direction of motion is reversed after collision the direction of motion is reversed reversed after the collision okay move on find in terms of u the magnitude of the impulse received by b in the collision state the units of your answer impulse okay first of all we need to find the impulse for b actually uh, that is not the big issue you can uh, you can apply the formula for a or b because impulse for a and b both are same equal in magnitude okay so that is your choice you are considering impulse for a or for b that is your choice you will get the right answer got it so uh, here we want the impulse for B. Impulse formula is I equals to M into V minus U. This is the basic formula. And we are considering this way positive for B impulse. M move back. This is the final speed for B and this is the initial speed for B. Okay. Initial speed is opposite to the impulse. Look, look at this diagram. Okay. So, to you is the same as impulse so this one you have to change the direction you have to keep minus here so i will be equals to m is 2 mass of b is 2 final speed is 2u and this the initial speed is opposite direction it is this way okay this u so you have to keep this minus what is the value for the initial speed that is 3u so you will have to you have to write here minus 3u you understand why we are taking minus here because it is in opposite direction this way we are considering this way positive now 2 into 2u and this minus and minus makes it plus so it will be 5u this 5u multiplied here so you get the answer 10 10u and unit for impulse is always newton second this is the standard unit for impulse so this is the answer for the last part of this question. Hopefully you understand it. If you have any question, please write in the comment box. Thank you.